up an old feeble woman. What's wrong? To their night blasphemers, pox take and profane the shrine to Verna the Merciful. Shrine's gotta be repaired, else Verna will take umbrage. Her cows will croak, and kitties will be covered in warts, and our dogs will get the mange. Warts and mange? Sounds dangerous. Fine, I'll help you. Done. The good gods have sent thee to me. Someone to repair their shrines from this day on. Look, already got a trade. I'm a witcher. Restoring traditional roadside structures in wood? Just not my specialty. Fight an evil? That's a witcher's calling. And vandals are worse than beasts. Fine. I see any damaged shrines? I'll take care of them. Won't go out of my way, though. Nothing's out of the way in these parts, and the gods will guide ye. What brings you here? Saw your notice. Can anyone tell me about the monster? I can. The patrol has been lost, somewhere along the south shore of Lake Windamer. We must know why. What makes this witcher's work? Some brickmakers live south of here. They call their village Byways. Almost empty now. Many have run away. They speak of a monster which kills. Redanians do not patrol there. That would be foolish. And robbers do not attack Imperials. That would be even more foolish. This leaves one option, a monster. You must learn what happened to this patrol. The Empire places great value on the lives of its soldiers. Do this, learn well what happened. The reward will be proper. Deal. I'll see what happened to your patrol, whether there really is a monster in byways. Good, good.
ghoul nest. Ought to just destroy it. Looking for a hunter named Neelan. Found him. What do you want? Hear about your notice. I'm a witcher. When do you last see your wife? Oh, five days pass, before dawn. On my way out to hunt, she were asleep. When I come back, I have no sign of her. Maybe she went to the neighboring village, forgot to tell you. No. My sister were never gone this long before. Tried looking for her? Asked around the village, none saw her go. She must have left when they were still sleeping. Told her time and again not to wander off on her own. She never listened. I must have some menfolk to scour the woods. Nothing. I'll look in the woods. You might have missed something. Ask around, too. She have any friends? Hannah kept... Keeps to herself mostly. Watches the blacksmith's young'uns at times. And in the village, Glenna, the butcher's wife, she likes her best. Thanks. I'll try to find her, but no promises. <laughs> Greetings, you Glenna. Aye. But gristle and marrow is all I'm willing to sell, and you'll have to wait till I'm done carving it. Wanted to talk to you about Hannah. Hear you were friendly. She come by at times? We talk? She seems strange lately. Any idea where she might have gone? Hmm. Strange. No? A cheerful soul always. If I'm to judge, it's the wolves got her. Been howling the nights through lately. Even the Baron's men are feared to come by. Hannah must have gone to the wood to gather mushrooms, maybe. Straight too deep and the howlers got her. You the butcher's wife? Butcher? Please. Might have called him a butcher when we lived in the shade of Novigrad's walls. Now he deals in carrion, fallen animals, their bones still fit for soup. So, buying something? Thanks. Farewell. My dad used to make swords like yours. Can I touch it? It's sharp. Better not. Need to talk to your father. I forged swords once. Now it's sides and o's. For good arms, you'll need to go to Novigrad. Wanted to ask you about Hannah. Heard she looked after your children. Uh, Hannah? Do you know where she is? No, that's why I'm here. She maybe tell you where she was going? Or anything else? She said turnips are healthy, and we ought to eat them. I saw her go to the forest, with another lady. It was dawn almost, but I'd gone out so I wouldn't wet the pallet. The forest? She's done for. Why? A huge pack roams the area. None from the village dares go in the forest. Neelan's only one not afeared, but then he's a hunter. Did you get a good look at the other woman? Know who it was? No. She walked in front of Aunt Hannah. I couldn't see. Did you get a good... No. Thanks. Farewell. Buying or just perusing? Wouldn't mind a few rounds of cards.
Let's go! forest alone. I came to tell you. You needn't look for Hannah. She'd have returned long past were she alive. I'll pay you twice Neilan's pledge. Just tell the man his Hannah's dead. Don't want to know what happened to her? I've no illusions, Witcher. And Velen, you're gone as long as she's been. You don't come back. Hannah's dead for certain. Neilan ought to accept his loss. Move on with his life. Sorry, not in the habit of leaving jobs undone. Folks speak true about you witchers. You're heartless beasts. Claw marks. Deep. did this. Hmm. Cuts. Made with long claws. Flesh torn clear off. This is getting interesting. Anna, blood spattered all around. Pieces, literally. Werewolf. No doubt about it. Gotta be careful. Blood and palm marks. Wonder where they lead. Shit. Climbed the tree. I can't get up there. Maybe find something else on the ground. It. Climbed the tree. I can't get up there. Maybe find something else on the ground. Tuft of fur. Uh, whatever lost it hasn't bathed in a while. sign of blood. Who rips their own clothes off, leaves them in the woods? Looks like a hunter's quarters.
Hmm. Blood's just barely dried. He was dragged here. Wonder where from. Show me what you got. Insane. Stand back, he's dangerous. Not to me, he's not. It's Nealon. Lycanthropy can afflict anyone, but it is a curse. So sorry, but I have to. You don't understand. I love him. He was near to being mine till you came along. Go away. Leave us be. What is this nonsense? I love him. Always have. Even after I'd learned his secret. You... You knew? Did you know I shoved myself in here to wait out me change? I knew, and I didn't mind. But you chose Hannah. I wanted her to see you. I wanted her to fear you. She'd not have stayed. And we could be together. You brought her here. That night. It was the reason I had the taste of blood in me mouth come morn. I did it for us. She was to see you turn, not more. I didn't want her death. You've got to believe me. I don't. And I'll kill you willingly. First time for that, in fact. You won't kill anyone, ever again. No! Don't hurt him! Get out of here before I change my mind. Run. Sorry it had to end this way. 